All right, here's a great question from 2008, question two, that's clearly on positive externalities and your ability to draw the graph. In this question, you analyze vaccines, which it tells you is a positive externality. So it asks you to draw the graph, the market price and quantity, and the quantity that's socially optimal and dead weight loss. So let's start drawing the graph. You've got a downward sloping demand curve, upward sloping supply. You know this from regular supply and demand. This is the quantity market and the price market, right? This is what the free market would produce if they're left their own. This is the marginal private benefit. This only factors in the benefits that individuals get from those vaccines. There's a second demand curve, right? That demand curve is out here, which represents the marginal social benefit. If people recognize the external benefits of getting a vaccination, that other people don't get sick, then the demand should be over here. Now notice, there's no arrow. This is a second demand curve representing the demand when you factor in those external benefits. The quantity right here is the quantity socially optimal or the amount that society actually wants where the marginal social benefit equals the marginal social cost. Now where is the dead weight loss? Dead weight loss is the triangle right here. This represents the units that we should produce but we're not. Right? Each one of these units, the marginal social benefit is greater than the marginal social cost for every single one of them but we're not producing so that represents dead weight loss. Now the graph right here is worth three out of the six points in this free response. The next question asks you what's the relationship between the marginal social cost and the marginal social benefit at the market output. So at this output, what's the relationship between the marginal social cost and the marginal social benefit? Well, the marginal social cost is less than it. Or the benefit society is greater than the cost society at the quantity free market. And that's why there's dead weight loss. The last part asks you if there is a tax, what happens to dead weight loss? The government comes in and taxes this market. Now you know they shouldn't because this is a positive externality, but if they did, what's happened to dead weight loss? Dead weight loss gets bigger. And the reason why is because the quantity decreases. If the quantity decreases because there's a tax, that's going to lead to larger dead weight loss and less efficiency in this actual market. Right? That's a fair response. Out of six, add it all up, see how you did? Try the next fair response.